Then in the nightcap game over at Counterclocks Field for the state baseball quarterfinals, the South Warren Spartans facing the Whitley County Colonels. The Spartans with a great opportunity to advance to the state semifinals next week. We start in the bottom of the second. Whitley has runners on first and second before Ethan Reynolds makes a spectacular play, getting the force at third and getting the out at first for the double play. Then at the top of the third, Camden Page with a shot up the middle, bringing in Tucker Bishop for the first run of the game. Then Ty Krogan, he hits a chopper down the first baseline and he is out. But the important thing is that he brings in Page for the score. Then this gets a little crazy. Ethan Reynolds has a high deep ball to left field. Andrew Stack has no idea where the ball is, and that's because it's way over his head as Reynolds hits a two run home run, capping off the four run inning for the Spartans. But no team folds easily in the state tournament. Whitley responded in the bottom of the third. Grant Zare gets a double into the left center gap and brings in two runs. But wait, there is more. He tries to round and make it to third, but he gets caught on the tag and he is out out in the fifth Whitley now has bases loaded down one when Casey Crowley grounds the short but a run scores and South Warren can't make the double play Whitley tied it up then the icing on the inning for the Colonels Matthew Wright hits a high pop up to right field but Brady Patterson takes a tough angle and just misses it two Colonels make it home and Wright makes it to third for the triple as Whitley used a huge fifth inning to take the win seven to four putting an end to a fantastic season by the Spartans.